Step one, uh, go to our website, www.southwestbusiness.ca. Once you go onto our website, uh, scroll all the way to the bottom of the page until you see the headings called templates and artwork. Click on that, and then all our templates are here. So the copier tab templates are under the copier tab section, and today we'll be doing fifth cut copier tabs. This is the template we'll be using. Once you uh, go click on the template, step two, it opens up the file. And now you can just open this guy up into another browser. We've opened up our copier tab template. And I'll just go through a couple of features here on our template. Over here is where you can enter in your, your text. Uh, over here is where you can actually change the font style. So if you click on the icon, there's two types of font styles that come up. And you can click on whatever uh, you, you feel works best for you. The third uh, tab here is the actual the size of the text. So you can either pick a small text or you can increase the text size. The fourth uh, icon here is the way your tabs are set up. So if I go over here, if I type in Southwest if you click on any of these icons, you can actually flip the, uh, the text upside down. Or if you're doing numbers, you can flip it to a vertical setting as well. So if you're doing numbers here, so when this prints out, it'll print out in perfect order. So let's go back to typing into your text. So we're going to type in some text here. Then all you have to do is hit the print setting here. So once you hit print, the print icon should show up. And now you can print your printer. Over here, you see the size of the sheet size is 11 by 9. That's the size of your actual paper size. So you, this is very important. Right? That's what you have to make sure you're, uh, when you're printing, this is the size that you're printing at. Once you do this, you can go into your property settings and then pick the printer that you're going to be printing this in. Hit OK. If you're going to print all five tabs, you have to make sure you hit the number five for copies. Once you hit print, it'll go into the printer and, and you'll have your final product. 